The central controller manages the entire grid, especially the line generator system. The central controller measures the output profile of the line generator system and sends some information to the storage in order to compensate intermittent behavior of the output power. But on the other hand, the storage is also multifunctional. They can perform not only their basic functions like store the charge and discharge the storage, but also may contribute to the power quality on the grid. So the central controller decides if the storage can perform ancillary functions like power quality enhancements, harmonic currents mitigation, or even sags and swells on the voltage profile. So this storage here is multifunctional. It's a kind of interactive storage based on the conservative power theory. So since the central controllers decide what the storage and the W generator must do, there is also a local controller, which is the communications between the storage and the W and the the wind generator system. So since the controls, for instance, the central decides that both of them sh should supply 500 watts so they can split by half, but in an over temperature event, they can communicate directly to the dump to the wind turbine system.